Carbon trading is a public policy that transforms carbon dioxide gas known as CO2 into an economic commodity. But how does this mechanism work? The state caps the amount of greenhouse gases, particularly CO2, that can be emitted by each industrial sector. Each year, industries are given individual quotas of CO2 emissions. For example, a cement works with a 300,000 tonne annual quota pumps out 360,000 tonnes a year, exceeding its limit by 60,000 tonnes because of its ageing installations. The plant must then buy 60,000 units worth of CO2 from another industrial facility which has kept its own emissions below quota and can now trade its surplus CO2. An example might be a thermal power station which emits less CO2 after upgrading its boiler. The power station can cash in the cost of the 60,000 tonnes which it sold to the cement works at the current market rate and recoup the money it invested modernising the facility. Carbon trading is a way for governments to persuade businesses to reduce emissions by investing in less polluting technologies.